Hi, this is Al. It's been a long time since I posted, but uh, we've been on vacation and I've been busy around the the farm. Uh, but anyways, I got my uh, battery bank uh, pretty much built. Uh, there's a uh, uh, a device right here that I uh, got that is a uh, desulfator uh, to keep my batteries uh, from ever sulfating and it's supposed to extend the life of the batteries uh, quite significantly. Uh, the bank is made up of 10 uh, deep cycle uh, interstate marine batteries. Uh, you can kind of see here what they are. Um, they're uh, 210 reserve capacity each, 125 amp hours. So there's 1,250 uh, amp hours on this bank, uh, which is more than enough for what I need. Eventually, I think uh, uh, maybe in a month or so, I'll add another another 10 down below, which is why I made the frame the way that I did. As soon as I can clear out that space and I'll put those the rest on there. That'll give me 20, 20 batteries and 2,500 uh, amps of capacity. And uh, we're going to be swinging uh, 11 circuits from the house over to uh, my inverters. Uh, that's the, uh, that's the uh, 4 kilowatt uh, trip light inverter. Really good quality stuff. It's heavy. It's almost 60 pounds. And then that Santrex, uh, it's a conversion module that takes uh, the 120 output of this uh, uh, inverter and uh, converts it to uh, 240 volts uh, two phase. So that'll power my well pumps and and anything that I have in the house that runs up to 40. Uh, I've been doing a little bit of work here and you can see I got my disconnects and for the inverters and for the battery bank kind of been cleaning it up cleaning it up quite a bit my batteries as you can tell uh, are really fully charged right now because I don't have anything really going on with those and if I look at my Outback uh, FM60 uh, it's floating right now so there's almost uh, and there's nothing going on because I'm not using the power at this point until I uh, get uh, the circuits brought in here and uh, and uh, have my home, essentially most of my home is going to be running off uh, the solar, the wind, and the battery banks. And once I add, uh, probably within a month I'll have the other 20. So I think we're almost there, uh, pretty close to it, and I just wanted to give you an update of what's going on. Uh, I'll show you in the next video uh, what we've done with the solar panels as far as the harbor freight panels. Those are done now. And I'll show you why we needed this guy and how that's working.